They say you come at the king, you best not miss. And for Syracuse, a second chance was all they needed to knock off the defending national champions, beating number 18 Virginia 63-55 on the road in overtime on Saturday. And for Coach Beheim, he said the team had been getting good looks, they just had to finally hit them. You know, we have to make shots, and, you know, at the uh, – in the second half, I thought we got good shots. You know, I thought Buddy and Joe and Elijah got the shots that we, we are going to have to make. Um, and the overtime, they got those same shots and they made them. And, you know, we're, when you make those shots, uh, that's the, for us to win, we have to make those shots. I think it's just making shots. Uh, you know, those shots, whether it's early or not, you know, you, you can make them. You got you to take them. So uh, we got a lot of shooters, a lot of scores on the team. And uh, you're bound to go in, so you just keep shooting them. That's a huge win. I mean, that's still a really good team. Uh, they just beat Virginia Tech by 15-20, so, I mean, that's still a really good team. And, you know, we just got to get ready now for Wednesday. It's it's a big win, but we're still, you know, we still got to get out of this hole that we're in. And, you know, one game at a time is all that matters. So it's a big win, but can't let us let it get too, too in our heads. Syracuse hopes this upset will light a spark that turns around its season, and that turnaround continues on Wednesday when they host Boston College at 630. Reporting from John Paul Jones Arena in Charlottesville, Virginia, Sean Scott, Citrus TV.